Hey guys, and welcome back to Audit Watch, the best place to find your favorite police interactions on the internet. Don't forget to like the video if you enjoy and subscribe if you are new around here. But anyways, let's get straight into today's episode. Gloves. This, yeah. is the, this is the on hands guy. No, haven't you heard this? How you, how you Have you heard there's a lot of tyranny in our police departments? Have you? Yeah. Okay. This video is brought to us by High Desert Community Watch. A big shout out to Phil and make sure you subscribe to his channel if you aren't already. The video begins with Phil filming outside of the port of San Diego. The employees where Phil is at call the cops on him. This is after he clearly tells them that he is flexing his freedom and just filming. The cops continue to question him anyway and even after his explanation. Phil tells the cops to kick rocks and argues with them. Watch the full clip to see the disagreement with Phil and the cops. This is the, the port of San Diego here. Entrance. My gloves. This, yeah. is the, this is the on hands guy. No, haven't you heard this? Have you heard there's a lot of tyranny in our police departments? Have you? Yeah. Okay. How are you doing today? Everything going okay? I'm being free. You're being free? Being okay. free, man. Perfect. You're in a place you can do that. Exactly. Yeah. So what's going on? I don't know you. I'm not going to talk to you. Okay. People, they get paid. They fly our flag. They take our money, but they don't want to be accountable. Shame on you guys. Good, man. Until, until I'm surrounded by a bunch of armed men. <laughs> yeah, that's our job, you know. Is there anything we can do for you? Yeah, you guys can kick rocks and go, uh, go back to work. Is there a reason why you're standing in front here? Yeah. What is that? Because I want to. How are you feeling right now, sir? I'm feeling great, man. Feeling job okay. Is you're live on the internet, so I would watch that's your steps. Fine. Okay. That's fine. Um, is there anything I can do for you to help? Yeah, you could go back to work. I'm not working right now. No, you're not doing nothing. You're law enforcement. There's no laws being broken. You need to go back to work. Well, they called us. Reference you. So that's an Then go talk to them. Then go talk to them. I didn't call you. I'm here to talk to you, sir. I don't not talk to you. Do you have to be that rude all the time? Yeah. I'm trying not to. Okay. I don't. I don't like being surrounded. I don't like being questioned when I'm practicing my freedoms. Just that's because right. a crybaby cry. Hey, whatever, 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 man. I want to hear it. You guys, I don't want to hear it. I don't want to hear it. So, just because a bunch of fucking babies are crying about a camera. Yeah, but you're, you're, you're filming us right now. That's my first amendment protected activity, which you swore no to, so shut the fuck up. You don't have nothing to say after that. Exactly. Get the Have a beautiful day. Yeah. Sir. That is so wrong. You feel like hurting somebody? No, I don't. How many, how many reports have you? are an old man. How many reports have you lied on? How many reports have you lied on? You put your head on your pillow. How does it feel knowing you ruin people's lives? These guys want to take our money, they fly our flag, but they... All this for freedom, guys. All this for freedom. All right, sir. Hey, have a good day. Thank All right, you. suck it easy. All right. A little snowflake, goodbye. Hey, how can we take our money? And you fly the flag, but you don't want to fucking be accountable. Yeah, you. You get paid by taxpayers. These cops certainly showed up pretty quickly. I don't know why these cops were here for so long talking to Phil for. The first few words they said were that he could be free here and it's a place where he could do that. So surely they have seen enough and said he's fine, so why not leave him be? But of course, the cops hang around and end up arguing with him. And like Phil said, he wasn't the one that called them, so why keep on speaking to him? Why don't you speak to the person who called you out and was the one who had the apparent problem? Get that out my face. Yes. Just make sure you don't touch yeah. me. Move Just back. Just make sure you back up. Move back, bro. You back you up. You came to me. You back up. You came to me. This clip is brought to us by Eli. Be sure to subscribe to his channel. Another big shout out to Eli. The clip starts off with Eli recording officers around the back of a courthouse, telling Eli that he will be able to record in the courthouse without any problems. But when Eli does go to record, he is told by numerous cops that he can't record and is shown a sign with no penal code attached. 
Eli disagrees with the guard and tells him that the other officer said that he could record. Watch the full clip to see if Eli is allowed to record or if the policy stands. What up? How you doing? No bad, thanks for asking. How y'all doing? Your pants are falling. Your pants are falling. They always are, man. Don't worry about that. What's this over here? This is a courthouse, civil court. Supreme. Oh, it's civil? Supreme? Supreme and civil court. What up? What's going on? What up? Can I get my people a tour inside? Nah, you well, can't go here. Yeah. You want to go inside, you got to go through the front. This is employee entrance. What's yeah. this? Oh, employee entrance? Yes. Yeah. But I could go in through the front and give yeah. my people a tour. I could record inside? Yeah. You sure I could walk inside and give them a tour? I don't want to get locked up. No, you're not going to get locked up. It's been happening, bro. Been... Right, I'm going to pull up, my people. Let me give you a tour inside. You heard? Yo, stop looking at people's clothes, bro. Yo, Relax. Stop, stop, stop being weird, bro. Uphold the law, nigga. Bro. Uphold the law, man. Y'all be safe, bro. Like, hold on, hold on. I'm missing your name and badge number, sir. Sorry. It's there. What is it? Watch your badge. Oh, sorry. It's there. What is it? It's I'm there. bad reading, bro. Oh, um, it's there. So, what's your name and badge number, bro? Well, Chief 77533. Thank you, bro. Oh, my G, what's your name and badge number? White 8309. Thank you very much. It's simple, man. Simple. Yeah, peace out, brother. Take care, man. Y'all too. Be safe. Not bad. Give my people a tour in the building. Huh? Give my people a tour in the building. Just give me one second. Let me just direct you to this right here so I can show you. To what? I want to just show you something here. What you going to show me? A policy? I go by the law, my G. And I was just told by, by, your, by your superior, I don't know, if, he, if he's a lieutenant down there. Down, right, where, down where? Behind in the back, in the employee entrance. Which one? Which in one? the back, behind, in the back of the building. In 158th Street? Be, in, the entrance, in the employee entrance in the back. Okay. I was told that I can come and, and I'm allowed to do this because we have the First Amendment right to record in public places. What was the supervisor's name? Damn, I'll have to go back on the video. It was like five cops over there. They, they was the one who told me to come, bro. To come through here? Yeah. And, okay. Yeah, they told me I'm allowed and I'm going to I'm going to pause it, I'm going to pause it. And I'm gonna show you the video, okay? Please. All right, my people, I'm gonna pause it real quick. I'm gonna show you the video. All right, so let me let me read it real quick. Please, yes. Court rules prohibit the use of cameras or audio video recording devices in this courthouse without permission from court administration or in a courtroom. The presiding judge, unauthorized use, will result conclusion from the courthouse exclusion. So, as you can see. That's the rules and procedures that we have implemented here in this court. I so understand, this is not a public building? I understand it is a public building. Exactly. But at the same time... So anywhere in public... That I, I, listen, listen, wait, wait. Anywhere that I am that's a public place funded by the taxpayers, mm -hmm. I have the constitutional right to record and to uphold the Constitution is your job. Correct. And I have a constitutional right. But there are... But there's other rules and procedures with the Constitution yeah. that are implemented. No, no, the not Constitution just... is not a rule, bro. There's no penal code behind it. What penal code is that? What, what penal code am I violating? No, no, I'm not saying you. I'm not saying. Just in case you want to throw me in a cage. I'm not gonna throw you in any cage. Hopefully not. Yeah, but no, no, but no. I'm just saying, like, okay, what penal code are you gonna put me put me in jail for? That, there's court rules. It says that if, if it would have been a penal code, yeah. it would have said. Penal and I'm subject code, to arrest, right? Penal code anywhere else, federal court, for example, or any other public building, you would have to go by their administration. Our administration is OCA. But you guys are supposed to go by the law. Correct. But what judge What judge did this, did this sign over here? Because I don't think no judge did that, bro. What, what's the, the name judge? of the judge? The chief administrative judge. What's his name? The chief of... You could... Listen. I need his name. Listen. So I could do research and I could have my people research. You can go into the court website. Who's the chief administrator? Who is it? You don't know him? Listen to me. Listen to me. Listen to me. Listen. The rules we are given. Who gave you that rule is my question. Above my pay grade. Who that? Like I said. Like I said. The chief So you don't even know who that is? All of us. See, now. now. I'm trying to find. Go. I'm trying to go and give me research. Give me one second. Yeah, please. Go ahead. Take your time. Take your time. What's your name and badge number? For the people. The people you work for. 
Get that out of my face. Yeah. Just make sure you don't touch me. Move Just back. Make sure you back up. Move back, bro. You back you up. You came to me. You back up. You came to my space. You started talking you to me. Up. You started talking to me. You back up. I you suggest you wait for the sergeant. I suggest you don't talk to me. How about that? Step over that. Move your hands away from me. Step over that way. Move your hands you away from your me. Hands in my face Who? With your phone. Man, shut Step up. Over man. Shut up. Keep doing your job. Step bro. over that way. Keep doing security. Step over that way. You got the right one. Step over that way. I, that's not a lawful order. We're going to head to the complaint, bro. I need to make complaints against them, bro. Okay. The same thing. Department of Public Safety. You, you, you could send it there. You could speak to somebody on how to do it in a written form. I can't do it here. You could tell me what happened and I could take and I could. You, you know, can do something about and it. And I could. I would love for you and to. I, and okay. I can okay, either there. reprimand or if something was done. Office, I'll speak to all of them together. I'll Great. Them Next together. time a member of the public asking for the name, please just provide Even it, bro. We do have it on our. I don't know, know how to read like that, man. And a lot of people here, not like okay. that, but a lot of people here don't know how to read. We have blind people here, too, you know? So they like to verbally hear. What was your name in back of Sergeant Dominguez, number 508. Thank you very much. It was okay. simple, bro. It was a pleasure. I'm back of the building, they tell me pull up. Nothing going to happen. These officers around the back of the courthouse seem pretty nice and even said that Eli could record in the courthouse. One officer does hesitate to give his name and badge number, but eventually says it out loud. The security was very quick to show Eli the sign that says he can't record in the courthouse. The guard admits that it's a public building and Eli tells him that he has the constitutional right. And the guard seems to stutter when Eli brings up the penal code. They end up arguing for a while and then a female officer decides to show an attitude towards Eli. Yes, sir. Barber. Yep. I got you, babe. There you go. Sorry. All right. Um, oh, we got we got another one. Sneak up on us. <laughs> Name. This clip is brought to us by NC Tyrant Hunter. Be sure to subscribe to their channel. A big shout out to NC Tyrant Hunter. The clip starts off with a man filming the Novo Nordisk Company building from the sidewalk. The man has the cops called on him from the security that works at the building. The cops that arrive are amazing at their job and honor their oath. They speak to the man for a while and get along the whole time and have a great encounter. Watch the full clip to see the cops walk away to educate the employees who called them on the man filming. They're right to record out here in public. What you, can I ask what you're doing? Yeah, you can ask. I'm asking. That don't mean I got to tell you. Can you keep it secret? I was just told to come to find out. If you can keep a secret. What's the secret? We can keep one too. But anyway. I need to know why you're here and what you're trying to do. Why? Okay. Okay, what? Debbie Barber. I can't, I can't hear you. you. Get a little closer. Yeah. Office. Barbers? Yes, sir. Barber. Yep. I got you, babe. There you go. Sorry. All right. Um, Red oh, we got we got another one. Sneak up on us. <laughs> name? Name? Sergeant Arnold. Oh yeah. Arnold? Yes, sir. Sergeant Arnold. Y'all don't have badge numbers or nothing, do you? No, we don't have badge numbers here at Sheriff's Office. Yeah, I got you. I didn't think so. What's happening? Uh, uh, what's going on with you guys? Beautiful day for filming. It is. I see it. We, went, we uh, went to Walmart and bought our cameras. So yeah, we're going to use them. I understand. I heard that. So, um, so the reason we're out here, just because they called, uh, I know that you spoke with. Uh, which well, one? They wouldn't identify, so I don't know which one it was. Was they, it a female? They were uh, two security guards. I talked to one of them. She asked what we was doing. I ain't got to tell her that. Don't got to tell you guys that either. So, I don't know what to tell you, man. I understand. Yeah, and that's the only reason we're out here, just... It's noise, yeah, yeah. <laughs> um, but that's the reason why we're out here, just uh, to talk to you guys and see why. And uh, as I explained to the, the female up here, I said, look, you, know, you guys are on the right of way. You're more than Thank you, sir. Field. Thank um, you, sir. And there's not really been any violation. Thank you, sir. Out here. And, 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 and you're leaving your trucks out there. Yeah, yeah, right, right. And we, and we know what to do, man. Oh, yeah. You know, this ain't our first time. Right. Right. This ain't the last time you guys will see us. What county is Johnson? Johnson, John, Johnson county? county. Johnson, yeah. Johnson County. With okay. a T. Don't, look, don't get confused with Johnson in Tennessee. Right, right, We're right. We're better than that. I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. I, I'll edit that out, sir. <laughs> <laughs> Y'all know any other good spots to go? <laughs> right. Yeah, that's the thing. It's like, 
I mean, technically, it, it is the right of way because you're right Absolutely, it. absolutely. And we, we got, I got a, a map on my phone right. that shows exactly where their line's at. And we know not to cross it. Right. right? And we never do. And that's, a, and that's a good thing. Like, I appreciate that with you guys. Yeah. You know, we, we do have some people to come out here and do a lot, a lot of First Amendment activist rights. Right, right, right. Yeah, yeah. Which some people don't do their investigation before they start filming things like that. Right, right. And, and then they might get on, you know, private property and right. then get in trouble. So you get all kinds, man. Yeah. It's a learning thing. Uh, you guys learn what we do. They learn what we do. Right. And, right. and not to bother nobody. If somebody's walking down this road right here, stopped and took pictures, you know they don't. They don't need to come out here and bother them. Because in the end, it's all about education. That's process. exactly right. Exactly. You know? I, 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 I appreciate think, I, that. I think that's something we all need to be educated. Absolutely. You know? That's never, all we do. Never stop learning. Uh, I'm nice to all you. You might see some videos if you watch them. I mean to officers only when they disrespect me. Right. I'll give it right back to them even ten times. Right. right? <laughs> and that's what I do. But you guys come up nice. Yes, sir. Look, I, and I appreciate y'all being. Nice and generous. Yeah, 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 yeah. No, like I said, if y'all respect me, I, I don't hate cops. So. But thank you guys for being uh, cordial, yes, sir. professional. Yes, sir. I really appreciate well, that. Have a good day. Right on, yeah, right on, man. Thank you. Yeah. I appreciate yeah, that. Especially good luck. Everybody can't drive. If everybody can yeah, yeah, right, drive, right, right, right. Just know that. No, we'll, we'll leave as soon as y'all leave. We'll be out. All right, guys, look, all right, right man. Thank you. Fine. Thank you, guys. Really, thank you so much. I appreciate y'all. Make sure I look good when you edit this. Hey, you're going to look good, baby. The cops who were present in this clip were great. They introduced themselves well and didn't come across rude at all to the man recording. They understood what he was doing and that he didn't do anything wrong. They even acknowledged that the employees should be educated on the matter. They even had some jokes with each other and all around it was just a great encounter. Well done to these officers. It's good to see officers who act like this and not like the others who refuse to identify themselves and are rude the whole time. Thank you to these officers. You can't be videotaping the prison at all, okay? So, um... What do you mean? Like, you can't you can't videotape the prison, like, any part of the prison. And this video is brought to us by Gem City News. Be sure to subscribe to their channel and check out their videos. A big shout-out to Ty. The video begins with Ty filming at the Oakwood Correctional Facility. Ty is told that he is not allowed to record on the property. The property is state property, meaning that the property is public. The officers point to a sign to back up their claims that he is not allowed to record, but the sign has no statute or penal code to back it up. Watch the full clip to see if Ty records where they say he can't. Oakwood Correctional Facility. We got... Uh, this is something about the lock shop. But it does tell me that Ed Sheldon is the warden, right? So then we could inquire with Ed Sheldon why we're not allowed to film the publicly accessible areas at a state facility that we fund and we pay for, right? Howdy. I wasn't sure if this was a footpath or a driveway. I, I wasn't sure if I was gonna drive up there or walk up there to look at that thing. Oh, uh, yeah, this, yeah, you can, you can drive up there and check it out. Well, it's a little narrow, you know what I mean? So it could be a footpath and they don't want you. And they sure seem to be cranky over there. I don't get it. <laughs> no, but, You can go check out the uh, memorial there if you want. So. Well, the way I understood it, when I called on the telephone to the Ohio State Patrol office, yeah. as well as this place, I was okay to come up here to the public accessible areas anyway. Yeah, so you just can't... You but can't, he sure got angry. I don't know why. He wouldn't even talk to me. Up to the... I'm saying if you, if you get up to the front, like where you can see the prison, you can't videotape the prison. Oh, I, I didn't. I, I videotaped in the publicly accessible area, show my viewers what the signs are, right? Uh, there was some confusion here the other day, and an auditor was thrown to the ground, and his phone was taken, and all sorts of stuff, you know. Um, certainly, I know, being older, I think I'm older than those fellows, <laughs> but I know not to get near that fence. I, yeah, right? I right? say back and then, well, I yeah. mean, wherever, you can't be videotaping the prison at all okay so um what do you mean like you can't you can't videotape the prison like any part of the prison and that's you know you're back that's why they keep it off the road so if you want to be back back away like you said um publicly accessible then you can then you can videotape whatever you want yeah that's why but i thought it'd be okay at the be visitor up center no you can't be up up front and, and videotape them that's why they have the signs there 
Well, there was nothing that said anything about, they said I can't videotape inside the visitor center. Can't take a phone inside the visitor yeah, center. Yeah, right here, there's two, there's two signs posted. No photos or videos beyond this point. Yeah. So if you want, if you want to hang out here, hmm. you're more than welcome to. But you can't, I mean, those are about as conspicuous as they come and you can't they, video. Yeah, they're a little, they're a little small. I did, I got to admit, I, I missed that one. But, right. For, so, to yeah. be honest, I did miss yeah. that one. But, but other than but that. But it's okay to walk up here? Yeah, if you want to go check out that, but. Well, I'd like to. Yeah. I mean, that's what I came for. No, you're more than welcome to. So, it's just a little memorial. They just, yeah. actually, this used to be the little drive up to the warden's um, quarters. There used to be a house oh, wow. that's up there. And then they redid it and kind of did their little memorial thing but yeah boy why would you want to be a warden if you have to live at the prison <laughs> well, you know what i mean so but yeah you're more than welcome to go check it out and do everything but you just can't videotape past those two signs right there okay okay so all right okay all right. yeah thank you sergeant yep have a good one they don't really want us on the facility recording anything near the visitor center uh they do have a sign over here it's a tiny sign it's just not very big uh, about no photos or videos on the property. And I don't think that's very good. This whole conversation was quite confusing. The officers were saying the whole time that he couldn't be videotaping the prison and Ty said clearly that he did not record the prison and the cops kept on speaking to him. These officers pointed to a sign that had no penal code to back it up. They did say he could check it out but couldn't record past a certain point. The officers didn't seem too bad they laughed with each other a bit and went on their separate ways. It's weird because the property is state property, meaning that it's then public as well. Thanks for making it to the end of the video, guys. Once again, make sure to like the video if you enjoyed and subscribe for your daily dose of police encounters.